What's up guys, Burn Sales Productions. Um, make this video tutorial, how to make this cool electro effect with Adobe Photoshop. As you can see, this is what you can be making, except not these little swirls I made, you know, these strokes. I, I additionally put that in, but uh, if you want to, I'll put up another tutorial for how to that. Just uh, let me know if you guys want that. Um, so without further ado, let's get that started. Um, see so what you want to do. Open up your Adobe Photoshop CS3, CS4. Um, I'll go ahead and go to the File, New. Make the width 1000 and the height 1000. If you want to put make a background for your desktop, put in your screen width and your screen height. But I just want to follow along. You know, just go, just make the width 1000 and the height 1000. Just click OK. Now what I'm going to do is want to make sure that this is black. So go to the Layers tab and click the background layer. What you're going to do is want to go edit, fill, use, black, and then click OK. Now what you're going to want to do is make some text. So I'll go to your text tool, put some text. Make sure that it's 150 and then put whatever you want. Burn status is, is mine. Make sure you center it. Um, now what you're going to want to do is that text layer you made, you want to right click it and go to duplicate there and name it whatever you want and just click OK. Um it's gonna you know, you want to go to that the, the layer. Not the copy, but just the one you made, the very first one. What you're gonna do is you want to go to once you have clicked on that layer, go to filter um stylize wind and click click OK if you have to. Direction from right, make sure its method is wind, click OK. Now you can see you got this little, like the wind is blowing the uh, text, you know. So what you want to do is want to, uh, um, on your keyboard, um, type control or CTRL control F twice. Okay. What you want to do again, you want to go to filter, stylize, wind. This time you want to go from the left and then click OK. Same as uh, last time, control F twice. All right. Now what you want to do is you want to go to image, image rotation, and 90 degrees C, CW. Now what you want to do is uh, go to filter, stylize wind again, and then click OK. You know, do CTRL F, CTRL or Control F twice again. Go to uh, filter, uh, stylize wind again. This is the last time. Now you want to go from the right, okay, and click OK. Now you want to go to Control F F twice. Now what you're going to do is want to go to Image, um, Image Rotation, and you want to make sure that it's 90 degrees C C W. That's going to go back to its uh, um, regular, you know, size. Um, what you want to do now is um, <clears throat> you can put the color on. So what you want to do is right click on that um, thing you that lay you made, right click it, go to blending options, go to cover overlay, and make it whatever color you want. You know, um, if you make it black, you won't be able to see it. So you don't want to make it black. I don't know how. Oh, there you go. Little color. Uh, I'll cancel. Now you can make it whatever color you want. I'm going to make it blue. You can make it blue. You can make it red. You can make it green. You know, just whatever color you like. Okay. Make it red. But you got that. All you have to do is go to File. Save as. And save it as either a JPEG. Or go to or PNG. Any any ones over there. Um. So once you save it, you're b basically done. Um. The additional strokes I made were <clears throat> will be in a different video. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial by Burnside Productions. Um. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please, please. There's a reason why I'm making these videos. So please subscribe. Um. And uh, this has been another Burnside's Reduction video. So, hope you liked it. Peace out.